to the bird's nest. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. I done tried to be nice. Max Kellerman, you are no longer allowed in Philly. Your pass has been revoked. I catch you in the city, bro. You're going to have a problem. Let's get into it. So listen, man, one of my favorite shows, I'm going to be honest, one of my favorite shows, First Take, okay? I've been riding with Stephen A since it was him and Skip, okay? I catch Skip every now and then, him and Shannon, you know what I mean? I'm a sports fanatic. Stephen A uh, has been in the Philly area for years. Uh, you know, sports commentator and writer and all of that, so like he highly respected. Max Kellerman, I bang with Max. Okay? Love his sports broadcast, and especially when he was with the box and stuff. Now he is, you know, part of first take and all of that. Max, you done out here, bro. You done, you done burnt your bridge, bro. You burnt your bridge, bro. If you was just being, um, you know, uh, 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 unbiased with this take, this, this take, which this year you have... When it comes to Carson Wentz, if it was unbiased and just fact-based, I'd be cool with you, bro. Because you normally are that way. Unless it's like you're about your football giants. But, bro, you are disrespecting my quarterback. And now I believe you have a hidden agenda against my Carson Wentz, especially with the blunder of your New York Giants, as well as, uh, you know, several other young quarterbacks. You are disrespecting my quarterback. My quarterback has now become the best quarterback in the NFC, hands down. He has done what no other quarterback in the NFC has done in the past, I don't know, 10 years. He has balled out and saved his team with the absence of weapons. Nobody, nobody, look it up, nobody in the NFC East, okay, has had all three of their starting wide receivers taken from them due to injury or whatever and still won games with practice squad players. Men lie, women lie, numbers don't lie. Respect him. The only other quarterback that you know of that has done such a thing or something close to it with no name players is one Mr. Tom Brady. And y'all got respect on his name. Why? Because he's a Super Bowl winning caliber quarterback. Yes, good job, Tom. Guess what? Carson is elite just like Tom. He has proven it this season. He has no one. He got high school football players out there catching game winning touchdowns. Greg Ward is catching touchdowns. He's not even a freaking wide receiver. He's a quarterback converted to wide receiver. He got Lamar Jackson out there catching touchdowns. Stop disrespecting my quarterback. Max, don't come to Philly. You're not allowed, bro. You better give it a year. You done out here, bro. Don't come to Philly, Max. First take, y'all good. Don't bring Max with you. I'm trying to told you, bro. I'm going to find out where y'all at. I'm coming. And I'm going to roast him. Fire. You hear me? Fire. Check out my videos. I'll blast your boy. Murder. Death kill. Facts. That's what I do. Facts. I might get emotional, but I go by facts. Max, you an idiot, bro. You're done out here. You understand? Don't do it. Carson Wentz is better than Dak Prescott. Hands down. If Carson Wentz had Dak Prescott weapons just this season alone, a top five running back, a top 10, arguably top 20 wide receiver, Amari Cooper, right? A reliable slot receiver, Randall Cobb, and a speed receiver, and Michael Gallup. You know what Carson Wentz record looked like when he got a speed receiver out there. Stop playing, man. They be undefeated right now, messing with Carson. 
I don't care what they defense do. You see what our defense doing? Trash. Carson is still winning. Which backups are backups of backups. Put some respect on his name. Don't come to Philly, Mac.